Assalamu alaikum guys and welcome to another episode of Smile to Jannah. One path. You know those guys that make those high quality dawah videos? Well, they now have an app. And this app is going to have thousands of videos. They're going to have prayer times. They're going to have adhan alerts. And this app is free for downloading. Honestly, it blows my mind. Yeah, I don't know why it's free. Why would you not download it? It just blows my mind, mate. Yeah, link in the description. What's this boy saying? Get on with the video. <laughs> the Slima Nasreen, a Bangladeshi ex-Muslim who now squats in India, has recently posted an attention-seeking tweet in which she, let's face it, she barked like a female dog, saying the following: If Moin Ali were not stuck with cricket, he would have gone to Syria to join ISIS. I mean, we're not even going to discuss the fact that she's got a grammar mistake in her tweet, despite being an academic. I mean, Moin Ali. If Moin Ali was not a human being, he'd probably be a sponge or a marshmallow. I mean, the guy is so, so look at him. Even when the guy is cheesed off, he's so relaxed. But Moin's fellow teammates, they just couldn't contain their silence. Yeah, and she went, she went out there without a cup and Mate, she paid the price. <laughs> Here's what Jofra Jofra Archer said. Yeah, he goes, "Are you okay? I don't think you're okay." Another guy goes, "Can't believe it! Disgusting tweet! Disgusting individual!" This was Ben Duckett. He goes, "This is the problem with this app." People being able to say stuff like this, disgusting. Things need to change. Please report this account. I know what you're thinking. What about the Indian cricket team? Surely they would have been first on the scene. But consider them like uh, retired umpires. They didn't lift a finger. <laughs> After getting violated by the Brits, she backtracked and claimed it was sarcasm. But again, an England cricketer fired back saying sarcastic. No one is laughing. Not even, not even yourself. Look, not only are you struggling with grammar, I think you're struggling with sarcasm. Yeah, sarcasm would be something like me claiming you know what a comb is, or saying your hair looks like it's trying to escape from your face, or me saying, "Look, I thought Moin Ali had fans, but he's clearly not the only one." Or if I was being really sarcastic, I would say, "It looks like the barber shaved you bald, got a bit worried, and then, and then stuck some hair back on." because he didn't want you to get suspicious. <laughs> Ironically, what triggered her with all this was Moin Ali just saying that he doesn't want alcohol advertisement on his jersey, yeah? Because currently he's playing for the IPL, the Indian Premier League, Cricket Premier League, yeah? So they put an advertisement, he said, I don't want it. I mean, what's what's your problem? The country that you are currently living in, the Prime Minister Modi, whose uh, group, the BJP, you're trying to impress, Modi doesn't drink alcohol. What are you going to say to him? I mean, it looks like she's she's too used to India and she thinks that the whole world is like this little bubble that she's in. But the whole world is not like that bubble. When you get out, you realize, you realize what time it is. Yeah, you realize what time it is. And you know what? This is the problem with the people that are ignoring the uh, Hindu extremism that's taking place in India. Yeah, this is exactly the problem. Yeah, the more we ignore it, the more it seeps out. And let's face it, China and India make up half of the population of the planet. So we can't ignore this sort of stuff. So call out hate wherever it is. And respect to my guy Moen Ali. I actually saw a uh, documentary of his just to get prepared for this. And what a remarkable guy. Very soft spoken, mashallah, very polite. May Allah increase and bless him. I'll link that in the description. Until next time, guys. Assalamu alaikum.